If you're an OG player to Hypixel Skyblock, then you probably remember grinding these particles inside of the end. These particles are now formally named Ender Nodes, and whenever you mine them, you have a chance to get items such as Grand Experience Bottles and a ton of other useful items that can make you a ton of coins in the early game in Hypixel Skyblock. And so today, I'm going to do a little test inside of the end to see just how much profit I can make by grinding Ender Nodes. And meanwhile, while I'm grinding these Ender Nodes, I'm going to run around the End Island and kill the Enderman here. And if you don't understand why it's actually worth grinding Endermen right now, they made a change recently to Endermen that makes a ton of profit by killing them. Not only can I make coins by grinding all of the Ender Nodes, but I can also make coins by killing the Endermen to drop Ender Gear, and every single piece of the Ender Armor and End Accessories can be sold to the NPC shops for 10,000 coins each. Alongside the drops that you can get from the Endermen, you can also spawn Nest Endermites from the Ender Nodes, and the Mite Gel that you get from those Nest Endermites can be sold to the NPC for 2 2,000 coins each. So I'm going to set a timer for one hour and run through the end island to see how much profit I can make. I'm going to use my gemstone gauntlet to both kill the enderman and break the ender nodes on the island. But if you don't have one, a sword and pickaxe can do the same job. So I'm going to set a one hour timer and see how many coins I can get in my purse. And at the end of the hour, I'll sell all of the total items I get and see how much profit we make. All right, so we're almost halfway. We have about 38 minutes to go. I have so many items already. You can see in my backpack slots here, here. Look at how many items I have in total. Every single one of these is 10,000 coins. You can see I got one auto recombed. I don't think that actually changes the price of it, but it would be cool if it does. I already have about two and a half stacks of my gel. I have some coins and I have a ton more items. This is going really well so far. All right, I got about three minutes left on my timer. I have accumulated so many items so far. All right, my timer has finished. I'm gonna mine all of these nodes real quick that I see here. There's like 15 of them. And then once I'm done getting all of these, I'll go back to my island and see how much profit we made. All right, so I started this with no coins in my purse and nothing in my mining sacks as well. We can see that I have 156,000 coins in my purse, but I'm going to quickly sell these ender pearls to make it about 167,000 coins. And those 167,000 coins are only from selling the ender pearls and the coins that I got for killing the ender mites and the enderman. I'm going to head over to the NPC shop in the hub. I have almost six stacks of mite gel that I can sell to the NPC. Let me sell all of these and you can see off of just the mite gel alone, I'm already up to 900,000 coins in my purse. I'm going to put away my weapons here and I'm going to start filling up my inventory with all of the gear that I got. I have just over three pages. Let me start taking this into my inventory and I can sell it to the NPC for 10,000 coins per piece. So uh, here we go. All right, and here we go. After selling the mite gel and the armor you could see we're already over 2 million coins in total so now all we have left to sell is all of the items we have here in this backpack i could sell these endstone roses for 3,000 coins each so i'll get 6,000 coins from those i do have a ton of runes that i'll probably just sell to the npc because i probably won't make too much profit from them so now that i got rid of all of my runes i can head over to the bazaar and look at all of the remaining profit that i got i got two titanic exp bottles and 131 grand xp bottles and adding that onto the endstone shulkers, which really don't sell for that much, I can make 1.1 million coins from all of these bottles. I'm going to put in a sell offer for these to try to make a little bit more profit. And these endstone shulkers really don't sell for that much, so I'm just going to sell them instantly. And finally, I got two shrimp to fish, which I could sell inside of the auction house for about 400,000 coins each. I'm going to put them up for 350,000 coins each, so I'm going to make 700,000 coins profit off of these two shrimp to fish. And my two rare enderman pets only sell for about 2,000 coins. Coins. And so instead of selling them to the auction house, I'm just going to head up to George and get 2,000 coins for each of my pets. <laughs> all right, I can head back to the bazaar. I got all of my orders to fill. I can claim my coins. And after the hour, I made 3.16 million coins in total. And I can also make 700,000 coins from these two shrimp the fish that I have inside of the auction house. Quickly, one thing I did forget to mention is that I can also sell my mining sacks for about 370,000 coins. And I'll also go back into the auction house to claim both of my shrimp the fish that did sell. So actually in total for the entire hour, I made 4.23 million coins in profit. And so even if you don't have the magic find that I do, you'll probably still make about three to three and a half million coins an hour. And for new players to Hypixel Skyblock, that is actually pretty good. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Be sure to let me know in the comments if you want to see other videos like this one in the future. And be sure to subscribe with notifications on to never miss another upload like this one again. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all next time. Goodbye.